Do you know someone who has been diagnosed with leukemia? Did it financially hurt their family? When I was 13 years old, I read the news that my cousin was diagnosed with leukemia. Being a single parent and having two older children, her mother became very overwhelmed. St. Jude is a hospital helping children every day. And I'm here to talk to you about the values that they're on their hospital by and different ways you can support them. The first thing we're going to talk about is their values. Their first value is commitment. They ensure the families that their child will receive the highest quality of medical care and support. Their second value is encouragement. They encourage the family that they participate in helping taking care of their child. The third value is respect. They respect the cultural and religious lifestyles of all their patients and families that come in. The next thing I'm going to talk to you about is different ways you can support them. One way is just by donating. At this hospital, the children who receive treatment do not pay for anything. The hospital pays through everything by donations that they receive. Another way to help is by participating in the St. Jude Dream Home Giveaway. This is one of the biggest fundraisers for the hospital. Every family who would like to participate buys a $100 ticket for their name to be entered in the drawing. If your name is entered and chosen, you then win the newly built home. One of the families who have on set were just so grateful and thankful this happened. It's amazing, really. <coughs> Every bit of money earned through this organization goes straight to the hospital to support the kids that are being treated there. Over the last 20 years, this program has raised more than $224 million and has awarded 280 houses to families according to St. Jude's website. The last way people can help is to partake in Partners for Hope. In this fundraiser, you give $19 a month to the hospital and in return you receive stories and pictures of the children that you are helping. You'll be receiving newsletters of other children with updates on how they are doing and if any new research is being done. The last thing you receive out of this program is a holiday card that you personally sign and put a message in that will be delivered to a child that is there for treatment. Now that you have heard their values, now that you have heard their values and organizations they are involved in, I hope you think about giving back because the smallest things can make a huge difference. Thank you.